guys, Ray Shears here from Blue Shield Tactical Systems here with uh, Albert Hughes from Genesis Jiu-Jitsu here in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, today we're going to be talking about a front thrust kick to make distance for law enforcement officers. Um, guys, obviously, uh, if someone's coming forward on you, back up for me a little bit. So if, if I'm telling him to stop and he's stepping forward at me and I'm in uniform, that front thrust kick is what's going to be useful to keep him back. Okay, so let's go ahead and use the back here. I'll demonstrate and then we'll talk about the uh, details of that. So we're here. Get back to back, and I do that front thrust kick. Notice, when I kick, I'm not doing this. I'm not just bringing my foot up. I'm bringing my knee up, putting my foot flat against the bag, and I'm pushing out. Okay. So again, I'm here, front knee's gonna come up, I'm gonna push out, and push him off. This allows me to be able to access something on my belt to make that distance. Why else would he be coming forward? Especially in uniform, I'm telling him to get back. He's, he's walking forward. I don't need to wait till he strikes me to try to do this is way too close. I need to maintain this distance, use that front thrust kick, now I can use something on my belt to keep him back. Uh, when you're training with your partner also, if they're holding the bag, make sure that your first kick, he looks at me and says, hey, is this where you want the bag? Here's the reason being, you may be training with someone who cannot raise their foot very high, and you hold the bag way up here, and they end up kicking you in the thigh because they can't get their foot up that high. So make sure that you tell them, hey, this is, where, is this where you want the bag? That way you're just talking about the injury aspect of it to make sure no one gets hurt. Okay? Guys, for uh, other videos, log on to BlueShieldTactical.com. Be safe out there. Thanks.